Hi guys, welcome to the third video of this series, Panda series, where I will show you how you can import the JSON data in Python. So JSON is a JavaScript object notation, which is a kind of a data source or a data format, which you can use as a cross-platform applications. And um, sometimes it has been given to you uh, via some platform, where maybe web or, or some other you know location which is uh, exporting you the data in a JSON format and you need to get that data in the Python for doing the data analysis so how you can do that we will show it uh, we will see it here in couple of steps all right first thing as always we need to import the pandas library and uh, we will also need the inbuilt JSON library to do the JSON related operations so I'll go ahead and execute this after that uh, here is the sample JSON data which has uh, country information and its value. It has a uh, products column and its values. It has location column and its value, contact column, payment column and its values. All right, so we will go ahead and execute this to create the sample data set. And uh, once we create this, Let's go ahead and load the JSON data in the format JSON underscore data that the JSON data format that we just created. So the function is JSON dot loads to load the JSON data and we are storing this data in the company underscore data object. So let's go ahead and execute this and now let's see the company data that we just imported. And here all that information is printed as it is. As you can see contact country location the payment information and the products information after that let's see if you want to access any specific element so for example here in this case payment what you can do is using the print command or simply by you know using the object company underscore data and specifying the uh, its attribute payment you can access the values of the payment so it is helpful sometimes uh, you know to get these values and to probably merge with some other data set or iterate through with some rows uh, you know rows to perform some sort of an operation so many times that way you need to access the specific elements of a specific object so here let's go ahead and print that and as you can see it is giving us the values which is present in the payment column over here all right now let's see how you can convert uh, the values or the column into a data frame so we can use the data frame object of the pandas library and specify which column we want to make the make it as a data frame and we are storing the values into a new object called json underscore df so let's go ahead and execute this and now let's see this thing in action so here we have created uh, sorry here we have the output in the format of a data frame which is much more meaningful or in a readable format which we are generally used to when we are looking at the uh, Python output or a pandas output after this let's see how we can uh, convert a file into a, or a convert a data into a JSON data so here we are creating one data set so we are giving a name column and a value bob h and its value is employed is true a boolean value and we are using the json.dumps bob to create the json data sets that's the function that you need to use from the json library so sometimes uh, your end user or any other user who is also working on some other application may have the requirement where they just need the JSON data because that's how they have done the setting. So when you are need to give the output, you may need to give the output into a JSON format and that's where it will be useful to use convert your data set into a JSON data. So using the JSON.dumps, you can dump uh, the object in which the data is stored and this bob underscore json will now have the json data so let's go ahead and execute this okay i need to execute this first i think i have not executed that 
and now execute this and now let's see the json data so here we have the json data uh, as it is printed which we have given it over here but uh, in a much more properly formatted way uh, which json probably uh, you know another source which needs a json format will be able to access it so that's pretty much all i have uh, in this uh, simple video where you know if you're a beginner in json and looking for how to access the json data you can follow this and get the data into your uh, python for data analysis